the micro switch this is a very common use of the micro switch and you can see in the market many types of the micro switch you will see the big uh, the si the biggest size and you will see the very small size but all of this type of the switch are they called a micro switch so here this micro switch here is three pin and this pin is common which means from the power source uh, coming in first and this pin is normally open which means always uh, off the switch gonna be always off if you use common to normally open and this is normally closed if you use from normal uh, from common to normally closed your switch gonna be always on so let's try common is red broad let's use common is red broad of the multimeter and normally uh, normally open then you press the button here once you press the button once you press the switch here then only your switch will be on but normally closed side if you connect to normally closed side once you press the button here your switch gonna be turned off so this is how the different normally open and normally close so now we're going to use uh, 240 volt AC to connect uh, this micro switch this micro switch you can use uh, 240 volt AC or you can use DC so before I wiring I'm going to explain you for this diagram uh, this is the live wire live wire coming to common and the live wire coming off from this normally open and connect to the lamp here and neutral wire from the power source direct connect to the lamp here so that's it if you want to use normally close uh, this terminal just switch to normally close so here uh, this brown wire is live so live wire, I cut it off here and live the point here and neutral the power source to the neutral direct connect to the lamp neutral here so unplug the plug point this is AC so this is very dangerous AC connect to common pin here now I'm going to use, I'm going to connect to normally open. So uh, we're going to connect to the plug point. Okay, we can see here, right? Okay, now turn on, which is the main source here. After you turn it on the switch, you uh, you cannot touch here because the the voltage is already supplied here. So once we press the button here, the light will be turned on. So let me try. So this is exactly the same fashion as a. Uh, push on button button switch so the things the different here when you use normally open you press the button here the switch will be turned on you release turn off so I turn off the power here and I would switch norm from normally open to normally close if you use normally close and the switch going to be reversed so once you on the power source the light will be turned on but if you press the button here the micro switch here the light will be turned off this is how the normally close and normally open the difference so we are using 240 volt AC for this here unplug the power if you use DC DC voltage a 
I'm gonna use a DC voltage for here. Let me test my DC supply. So right here, so I get a five volt. Five volt. You can use either as five volt. You can use twelve volt. It's uh, no matter how many voltage you use. Uh, the switch uh, has no problem. You can handle 12 volt, 24 volt, uh, 240 volt AC, DC, and AC both. You can use for this type of the micro switch. So I'm going to use the DC. So for DC, this the red color, the red wire is uh, positive, and the black wire is negative. So the black wire I connect to the motor here and the red wire from the red wire red wire I connect to common pin of the switch here I'm going to do this for testing purpose so I didn't use the cable for here And the red wire, positive here, I connect to normally open. So the wiring for this video, both AC and DC, are exactly the same. The difference is only for uh, we are using from the AC live wire. We cut off the live wire and go to the common and out from normally open. For the DC, I cut off here uh, positive wire and it goes to common here and positive wire out from normally open and connect to the motor. So I'm going to use so. From the DC, negative wire directly connect to the motor one side. So I hold the motor here. If I press the button, the micro switch here, the motor will be turned on. The moment you press the limit switch, micro switch, the motor will be run. If you want to keep running the motor, you need to keep pressing here. So this is how they use the micro switch. Guys, thank you for watching.